going to show you why you need the natural minor scale in order to understand harmonic and melodic minor scales. I know at least when I was a student and my teacher gave me the sort of old fashioned scale book, natural minor scales were just not included at all. It was just harmonic and melodic with pretty much zero explanation. So this video is going to solve that for you if you're in the same category. Now for every major scale, say C major, we have a relative minor that uses the same keys. And to find that, you can either go to the sixth note of the major scale, so in this case that would be A, or the trick we can use is to go down three half steps, brings you to the same place. So we would say that the relative minor of C major is A minor. Now if we change nothing, that's our natural minor scale. So C major is all white keys, A minor, a natural minor, would also be all white keys. Same thing for say G major, if we find its relative, we go down three half steps, E minor. E natural minor then would only be the F sharp, because remember relative means both scales use the same notes. So we'll keep that F sharp. There's our E natural minor scale. Now this is so essential because this is the baseline, so to speak, from which we make the changes for harmonic minor and melodic minor. So for harmonic minor, we'll use Going back to A minor, using this as sort of our starting point, we're going to raise the seventh note a half step, going both up and down, so that would be G sharp. And then for melodic, we raise six and seven going up, and then lower them coming back. But you see, if I didn't have that natural minor as my starting place, then I'd end up getting really confused with how this whole harmonic melodic business works. Now, if this is new for you and you wanna learn more, tap the link below. This is our complete guide to natural harmonic and melodic minor scales, why they exist, musical examples, the whole thing. So if you want a complete understanding of this, be sure to tap that link and I'll look forward to seeing you there.